Um, so what about surviving the hunt? We see the rise of fascism. Okay, we see, yeah, we see. And assuming that we can't get our shit together yeah. enough to resist. Right, there's, okay. Uh, 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 so like in, in, instead of being out there breaking the windows and uh, and lighting the fires or may, or maybe in addition to uh, but not uh, and, you know we're just you know we're just talking you know small scale property I mean you know property is God here and, and you know you're attacking God uh, in Nazi Germany uh Fascism came about, and it traditionally comes about as a result of uh, uh, a clash of two classes. Uh, the ruling class, uh, there has been a challenge to the ruling class by the working class forces. And they struggle and build and grow and get to the point almost where they can topple the, the class enemy, but they don't have the strength and they fall back. The ruling class doesn't have the power to get back up there where it was. And in comes this third force based on the petty bourgeoisie, the middle class. Uh, and in comes fascism rooted in that class and, 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 and is able to, to seize that prize and implement its version of, uh, of, of political reality. And that's what happened in Nazi Germany and that's what happened in, uh, in, in Spain, or in, uh, in, uh, well, in Spain too, and, and also in Italy. So. And then once fascism comes to power, it starts gutting uh, civil liberties and, and, and the rights of peoples and, uh, se and, and, and separating certain people out for scapegoating. And that's exactly what's happening here, only we haven't had, there's been no challenge. There's been, they're just, they're just doing it. And, uh, and, and it's incredible. And I, th I think, you know, if we look back in, in, uh, in, in radical history, there's, you know, the Chiang Kai-shek uh, uh, going after the progressives, the, the, the Shanghai massacre, the, uh, the Palmer raids here in the United States in, uh, by Attorney General, General Palmer in 1919, rounding up uh, uh, tens of thousands of radicals all across the United States, uh, deporting uh, thousands uh, out of the country like Emma Goldman uh, uh, back to Russia. Uh, there, uh, and those things are, I mean, we haven't had the roundup yet, but I mean the de deportations are going on now and the lockups and, and the gutting of rights. Well, gee, it doesn't take, you know, rocket science to say, uh, I'm an enemy of the state and, uh, gee, do you suppose that, you know, they could be, you know, c coming after uh, me one of these days or my community? And, and what if they do? Where am I going to go? What am I going to do? How am I going to survive? And so, the anarchist community is, is just really good at being able to at, at being able to uh, live inexpensively and 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 eat out of uh, dumpsters, dumpster diving if necessary, and to and to and to and to and to not consume a lot, to live lightly on the earth, uh, which is what it takes to survive the hunt. Um,